Val, um, firstly, a fantastic result on on the weekend. Uh, how good has it been to see see the guys get a result and you know lift themselves and and, and get three points on the board? Yeah, it was really important. I think that we uh, we were desperate to to win a, to win a game. Um, um, another difficult difficult game, but uh, we stay calm all the time. Um, we, we should have scored earlier to, to get that breakthrough earlier, but I think that we control the, the game and we stay calm and we score three, three goals at the end, but the game is 90 uh, plus minutes and then you have to, um, to force your, your destiny in every, every game. Uh, with the, the performance and especially from, from the bench, uh, the impact we, we need every time to, uh, to, to change the, the way uh, the way from from the the results, and uh, yes, this is what we uh, what we need. We are very delighted from the performance from Grady Diangana, from Robinson uh, when they they came in. Um, now it's all about the next step. I think it was important to get that confidence back, the relief for the for the player to get the the reward and to uh, to stop the bleeding now with uh, the run without a, a win and and now to create another momentum with a positive way with the with the next win. Yeah, of course it it came at a cost, so didn't it? We saw Daryl DK come off injured early in that second half of have, have we found out exactly what the injury is and the extent of that injury yes exactly uh, yesterday night i spoke with the with our doctor and uh, unfortunately it's a really bad muscles uh, injury so he will miss uh, eight weeks uh, it's a bad uh, hit for for us um, because it's our um, transfer number number one um, and we saw in, in, in a short times uh, how good it is to, to have uh, to have DK. Um, so it's it's painful for for me, for us, for for the players, uh, for the club, and for sure for the fans. Yeah, and it must be you know really frustrating for him as well, having come yeah. in and he yeah. looked really impressive when he first got going. He was looking to take one of those chances, and then yeah. obviously a real a real blow for him personally. Yes, we, we saw straight away that uh, he comes in the first half, uh, three big chances to, to score, second half, uh, another, another one and, and then come the, uh, the injury. Um, but it is what it is, this is the, the things you can um, influence in football, is uh, injury and, and Covid uh, and uh, you have to deal with it. Um, with my staff, we uh, we need to stay focused on the on the next next game because with DK or without DK, you have to win the the next game. So it doesn't change uh, anything on our on our on our task. But it's clear, as I say, you want to play with your best uh, team and and your uh, strength strong uh, team. And then now we have we, with DK one uh, one player less, but we have still very good player in the in the squad to um, to win games. Yeah, and on the more positive side, we saw Dara O'Shea, you know in match action uh, for our PL2 side. Yeah. Were you happy with him and, and obviously has he come through that game okay? Yes, very happy with his improvement. He played 45 minutes. It was the first big test for, for him after such a long uh, period of uh, injury. Um, he's very happy. I spoke with him uh, after, the, after the game. Um, fine. So now the next step for him will be on Friday. It's another uh, game with the 23s, another 45 minutes. So it's mean Throughout the week, he will have play uh, 90 minutes. So and, and we go from from there. And in midweek, we've got Preston. Of course, how important is it to follow up a, a really good result on the weekend with, you know, hopefully a similar one? Yes, this is what we need. We need now to uh, to carry on um, um, to create momentum. Uh, the money time is coming now. So um, close to the to the the end, with a lot of of game. Every game are very very important. And now it's all about to uh, to keep going, to keep the the, the pressure, and uh, just to uh, to get the the job done. I think that we, when when you see all the the statistic and all the the the, 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 the results on next to the pitch or with the the squad, the way to play uh, with the the young players. So I think we are on the right way. Uh, we do a very very good job. But uh, at the end of the day, it's all about to win game with the. Uh, with the squad and, and this is what we what we need and we need to win game we need to 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 get that confidence back and to create that momentum and and and, and to get that big confidence we we need to reach our purpose and always good news to have two integral players back really from from this season Alex Moa and, and Sam Johnston it's good to to have them back available isn't it 
Yes, the more we can get the player back, the more we have the full squad availability, uh, the more it will be easier for, for us to, um, to have the quality um, to play with your best uh, team or the, the best player for the, for the game you, uh, you need. You have the, the, the challenge in him training, everyone wants to be part uh, of the, the process to be in the squad or to, to start the, the game. So you raise the quality in training, so automatically you will raise the quality in the, in the, in the game. So it it's, it's looks much, uh, much better. Uh, but now it's, it's all about the, the next step. And finally, Val, we're in the, the final week of the window. Is there any chance that it could be a busy week or you know, potentially one you look to, to act upon given Daryl's injury? Yes, it's a tricky one because it's clear we, we got already our um, target number one we wanted with, with Daryl. So the good thing is a long term contract we, we, uh, we have with, with him. So uh, on the short terms, we will miss him. And the question is, how can we fill the short terms uh, without him? Um, is someone available on the market? where we, every one thing he can help us, so we need someone who make us better, uh, is straight away available and can play and uh, without to spend a lot of money. So it's, 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 a, it's a tricky one. So we will assess the, the situation. So uh, behind the, the scene, we keep uh, pushing and uh, we, will, we will see if we get that feeling, we can find the right one for the short terms and it makes sense for us, we will do it. Otherwise, uh, as I say, we have um, enough quality in the, in the squad to, uh, to score goal.